pulling back. Two minutes until our reinforcements get here. Thirty seconds left. Tank is retreating. The enemy tank is advancing! Alright, welcome everyone to today's video and today we have some World War II early gameplay footage and huge shout out to Activision for actually providing the travel and the stay for when I was there and we had a great time playing this game so let's just get right into it. We got some war here and this is some nice little gameplay just here and there. Uh, I decided to chop it up a bit because we actually got more time to play it, uh, just more than usual, you know, because this time we got to play it, you know, like two or three times a map, still didn't get as much good gameplay as I personally wanted, um, but, you know, I just kind of have a higher standard for myself, but that's enough of that, let's talk about the game, alright, the biggest thing, there is two sniper rifles, alright, there is the carabin, and I'll have gameplay of that later on if you guys want, and the carabin, it's kind of whack, honestly, I'm being 100% real with you guys, it's a semi-auto, it's like the WA-2000, and it's just not super there right now. You know, it's kind of just like one of those guns where you just go for headshots. It's it's, it's alright, it's alright for that. But the main sniper, that is kind of right now, is the Commonwealth. And the Commonwealth, very fantastic gun. Um, kind of feels like a little slow, but that's the big thing here, guys. There is, in fact, rapid fire. Yes, and extended mags. Pretty crazy stuff, man. And if that means, if that means if the Commonwealth can get extended mags and rapid fire, who's to say the Springfield can't? Who's to say that's not possible? But it hits pretty well. Honestly, I get more hit markers with the Commonwealth than I do the Springfield. And I didn't get to use the Springfield at all in this beta, so I actually have no idea if it's going to be there. So, who knows? The Commonwealth, though, does pretty well. I was going for some crazy no-scopes here and there. Uh, I was going against T. Martin, like Nade Shot, Chaos X Silencer, Legion... Just everyone, man. Just everyone. All right. Drifter was there. Everyone was there, man. And we are just all going hard against each other. Like Cross, I'm pretty sure. Agony. There was the snip There were the snipers on the other team. So I had to go deal with those guys now. Never have to really deal with snipers on the other team whenever these types of things happen. And I'm normally pretty relieved. I'm like, yes, sweet. A normal lobby, basically. But it's on land and everything too. So this is War. In case you're new here, I actually have some other gameplay um, a while back. I don't know how many months ago it was, but I have gameplay from back then. You can go ahead and check it out and uh, use the Springfield and it's showing more off about this map. So War, if you guys don't know, and if you guys, you know, already know, it's basically like, like the Overwatch, Overwatch game type. That's the best way I can describe it. If you don't know what Overwatch is, you basically capture an objective and then you forward a tank and to make the tank go you have to build a bridge and then halfway across the bridge you take out their ammo supply and they can build up like a wall and all that and you can take it down you gotta bomb it and then you gotta plant the bomb and they gotta defuse it somehow and then if you get through all that then you get through the final siege and this is if you're on offense then bang you win the game and then the other team gets a track then the other team gets a crack at it as well so if they get it they get it if they don't guess they kind of suck guess you're the winner so it was actually kind of hard um, playing on this map too, specifically because there's just so many snipers, and specifically this cross bridge area here is literally the most sniper spot ever. And um, I imagine there's going to be a lot of crazy stuff that happen on this bridge because really, like you're just trying to the game stops if you don't get to do the bridge. So, so if you keep them off here, then you know you end the game pretty uh, pretty fast if you're on defense. I don't know. Enough of that. If there's any questions and if there's anything you guys have to ask, please feel free to comment down below. Go for it. And I have this other cool series that I'm just... I, I wanted to show you guys. It's kind of like a mini-series type thing at the end of each video. But I want to make sure it's all good to go and we're on, this, on the right path for, uh, for, it to be, to, for it to just be something else and for it to be something special. So um, just enjoy the gameplay. If you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys are excited for the beta, drop a like. And... Again, I'm so happy to be back. This is like my second video here today. First game, first video back. Double uploading. It's crazy. I uploaded a montage as well. If you guys want to go ahead and, ahead and check that out, it'll be in the description below. Or you could just, you know, go back to the channel and subscribe and then check it out. So, I'm also Epic Magier. Enjoy the gameplay. World War II beta right around the corner. I'm also Epic Magier. I will see up to gorgeous faces in the next video.
until all your reinforcements arrive! Command post is under attack! So take the command post! Stop the enemy from rebuilding the bridge we destroyed! If they succeed, their tank will advance! Keep the enemy from building the bridge. They're building a bridge!
One minute left. have destroyed our ammo supply, but the battle is far from over. Keep the enemy from escorting their tank within range of our flank guns. The enemy tank is advancing! The tank is on the move! The tank is retreating! Kill the soldiers around that tank! Their tank is advancing! The enemy tank is advancing! The tank is on the move! The tank is advancing! Enough for reinforcement. 